welcome you to arguably the biggest match in WSC's history, where the Tribal Chief and the American Nightmare put both their titles on the line. Winner, take all! The following contest is a winner take all championship unification match. Introducing first, from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing at 220 pounds, he is the WSC World Hardcore Champion, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes! Many of the WSC faithful here look to this man as their one and true deserving hardcore champion, the greatest hardcore champion in the history of this company. But I have a feeling that tonight will be either the best night in Cody's life or the most heartbreaking moment in all of WSC's legacy. In this historic match, we will find out who will hold the Multiversal Championship for the last time as that championship will be retired and absorbed into the World Hardcore Championship. And you know what? I'm sick and tired of the Multiversal Championship. Yeah, that's right. I'm happy that thing is going away because I've had enough to hear with watching Psycho Killers going at it and fearing for my freaking life, Nate. We will all cherish the memories of the Multiversal Championship, but the Multiversal Era is coming to an end. But will this man remain the GOAT of the Multiverse? One may say that this man is the one and only final boss in WSC. No one comes close to the dominance that Roman Reigns has displayed throughout his time in WSC. A man consumed by power is Roman Reigns. What will WSC look like if he becomes undisputed? Making his way to the ring, accompanied by the wise man, Paul Heyman, from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, he is the WSC Multiversal Champion, Roman. Hooray! Whether you like it, whether I like it, whether anyone in this freaking building likes it, that man is a household name. That man is the needle mover, the head of the table for a reason. Absolute dominance on full display every time he steps between those ropes. And now he's looking to take away Cody's victory, Cody's legacy. Dusty Rhodes' kid is in for a hell of an awakening tonight. Roman Reigns is not content with one championship. He cannot live in a world where he is not number one at the top of WSC. And he sees that WSC has been claimed as Cody's kingdom, and he cannot allow that. Many of fans wonder, what is next? for WSC if either of these two reign victorious tonight. Holding both championships above their head, the Multiversal title and the Hardcore title. What an image that will be. This is an epic showdown of champions. Two of the greatest champions of their respective championships in WSC's history. This is going to be one for the ages. Cody Rhodes has already run through the gauntlet when it comes to the challengers that he has faced within his title reign. But now, it all comes full circle, really. Cody Rhodes' title reign didn't pick up steam until after he defeated Roman Reigns. That, in my opinion, was the defining moment of that young man's career here in WSC. But only time will tell, only this match will tell, only war will tell who out of both of these men, both of these generational superstars, will be the one to name themselves the true king of WSC. Things have reached a fever pitch tonight. All around us are men 
women and children just like you and me who wonder where is this company going to go? But it seems like Cody Rhodes is finding out the answer right now with the bloodline surrounding him like a pack of dogs. But wait! It's Dustin! Cody's big brother and Jey Uso! The Calvary has arrived! It's a hardcore match, but Jay and Dustin aren't gonna let it become bloodline rules, no sir! And Cody Rhodes fighting back against the Anawaii Dynasty! With that uppercut, ducks the clothesline! Disaster kick to the face! The Multiversal Champion taken down, he could be in serious trouble here! Roman Reigns already retreating to the outside! As the American Nightmare is looking to prove his name against Roman Reigns! But Roman had an answer with that huge uppercut. That's what I call a receipt after that massive disaster kick. And just like that, the gravity of the situation has settled itself into Cody's psyche. As Roman Reigns, wait a minute, Cody Rhodes through the roof with a suicide dive. Roman Reigns thought he would bring a chair into this, but he eats some steel courtesy of those steps. And Cody Rhodes. Pulls out a sledgehammer from under the ring. Roman Reigns with a flying Superman punch off the steps. Damaged leg be damned. That's Cody Rhodes is seeing stars. Indeed seeing stars. He's trying to get to that sledgehammer, but Roman with the steel chair. Now attacking viciously the ribs. Roman Reigns wants to end Cody Rhodes for what he did to him. He blames Cody Rhodes for the dissension of his family ever since Cody Rhodes beat Roman Reigns to retain the Hardcore Championship. After winning it at WrestleMania, Roman Reigns wants to right all the wrongs, but Cody Rhodes is gonna go down swinging. Cody with a sledgehammer and he's gonna use it. Trying to break the ribs of Roman Reigns, a little bit of payback there. And now Rhodes, he's not done just yet. Now Roman Reigns is a sitting duck, but wait, is he? Off the ropes, another Superman punch, right to the jaw, and the Tribal Chief is in his element. And now Reigns preparing to finish Cody Rhodes, locked and loaded. Prepared to take the kingdom from Rhodes by force. And now the needle mover, looking to hit another Superman punch by White Cody Rhodes with a counter, but Roman Reigns is fighting it off. Superman punch connects. And now Reigns charging in. Oh, a thrust kick to the face of Roman, but oh, a spear, spear in midair. That's it. Cody kicks out. Cody Rhodes tried to get the better of Roman Reigns with the speed advantage, but Roman Reigns took him down nice and quickly with the spear. Roman Reigns smart to lock in that guillotine. He needs to desperately squeeze out any fight, any life that Cody Rhodes still has. Oh, how good would it feel for Roman Reigns to force Cody Rhodes to go to sleep on his last night as WSC Hardcore Champ. But Cody fighting up to his feet. Roman Reigns can't believe it, but look at this! Wrapping the legs around Cody's waist to heighten the strain and the pain on his neck, but Cody just won't go down! And Cody drives Reigns into the turnbuckle! And now look at this, Cody Rhodes with the pedigree! Face first onto the mat! Is it over for Roman Reigns? Roman gets the shoulder up! I should have known better! It takes a lot more! Then a motif from the King of Kings to take down the Tribal Chief. And it looks like the Hardcore Champion wants to get Hardcore. He's introducing some tables. Cody Rhodes looking for double-decker tables. Roman back on his feet, but he eats that elbow. And now Cody Rhodes positioning his opponent. The scourge of his life so far in his career in WSC. And he's looking to put an end to it, but wait, Roman! Superman punch and down goes Cody through the two tables! My God! Did you hear the sickening crash of Cody's body through the tables? But he still fights on! In an effort to try and take down the Tribal Chief, 
He may have taken too long setting up those tables. And it backfired big time. A huge crash. That was about as nasty as they come, ladies and gentlemen. But Roman Reigns is not done with Cody quite yet. No, not by a long shot. It's smashing time. And now Roman, look at the smash in the face of WSC's hardcore champ. We've seen Cody Rhodes go through some brutal battles as hardcore champion, but Roman Reigns is just on a different level. Everything Cody has been through has led to this one faithful night, and Roman Reigns is about to take it all away. Looking for a spear, but oh! Cody able to dodge, able to leap out of the way. He has him in his clutches with the crossroads, but he's not done. He's never done with just one. But so is the Cohen now! Samoan spike to the throat! And now Roman off the roof with another spear! Two spears to end it all! Cody kicks out! How the hell did Cody kick out of that? Two spears and a Samoan spike, what is he made of? A lot of detractors would call Cody Rhodes a kick out merchant! I, for one, call him nothing short of a warrior! But off the ropes of Roman, another spear when he gets Solo Sakala! Oh my god! He cut his cousin in half! And now Cody! Super Cody Cutter! From the top rope! And Cody Rhodes with the battle cry that his father can even hear up in the sky in heaven! Oh, wait a second, Jimmy! And Cody takes out Jimmy! Nothing's gonna stop her own! What the hell? What? What? It's The Rock! What on earth is The Rock doing here? Why did he just... Why did he just rock bottom? Cody Rhodes! The last time we saw him, Roman Reigns defeated him at WrestleMania! I'm starting to think that ever since losing to Roman Reigns a year prior at WrestleMania, I think The Rock, the High Chief, acknowledges the Tribal Chief! No, 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 not this way, please! Cody takes out once more! This is how much the WSC Hardcore Championship means to Rhodes! This is, this is unbelievable! But The Rock, trying to make sure that this kid just stays down, knows when he's beat. I mean, how can one man take on an entire bloodline? He's not alone. His brother Dustin is here. But can he make a difference? Even with Dustin Rhodes, the numbers game proves too much. But here comes Jey Uso attacking his brother. But there's The Rock to cut it all down. Roman Reigns watches as his family does all the fighting for him. That coward! Roman Reigns looks perplexed. He looks like he's surprised to see the Great One here coming to his aid. Like I said, the High Chief acknowledges Roman Reigns. I am at a loss for words. Cody Rhodes is in dire straits. Understand me! Understand me! The top of the mountain is mine! And you won't ever have it until I'm done with it! You understand me? Roman Reigns saying it like it is to the face of his challenger. And at this point, I guess we can consider Roman Reigns the brand spanking new, undisputed, hardcore champ! What?! There's no way! There's no way! I can't see him! Is he here? The franchise is here! John Cena just can't stand idly by as Cody Rhodes gets screwed once again! And now John Cena taking the fight to the bloodline! And now, looking for an attitude adjustment on the Solo Sokoa, but Rock once again Spoils the party for everyone involved who are against the bloodline. And now it's three on one. This is ridiculous. Roman Reigns barking as his dogs maul John Cena. And it just keeps getting better. Oh, hell yeah. The 
Texas Rattlesnake is here to race some hell! The Rock's past is coming to haunt him! Here he is! On an ATV at that! The bloodline at a standstill! The Rock looks like he's seen a ghost! But you're not seeing things from a bull! Austin is here to whoop some ass! Stunner! Stunner to Jimmy! Took out his entire nervous system with that one! And these two legends going at it! The history speaks volumes! But Roman Reigns saves his cousin, his big cousin, the High Chief! And now the toughest SOB with the stunner! Austin just ate that Superman punch like it was nothing! Hey, ain't a Roman! And now Cena with the rock! The nostalgia's real! Hey, hey to the rock! Austin! Stunner! Austin and Cena have neutralized the bloodline! Oh, happy day! Once again, Cody Rhodes has a chance to finally end this! Just cover him, Cody! Do the honors! Make us proud! Make your father proud! Win it all! What? How? How is this still not over? When will this madness end? Roman Reigns locking and loading. Cody Cutter once again. Do it, Cody. Finish him. Crossroads. Rolls through. Do it. Again with the crossroads. Looking to put him away. Third one incoming. What the hell? Jay! What are you doing? Oh my god! Has Jay Uso lost his mind? No, no, no! Spare! Oh god, please don't tell me! Not like this! Roman Reigns has become undisputed in WSC! Here is your winner and unified multiversal and hardcore champion, Roman Reigns! What the hell just happened? One second, Cody Rhodes had this match won. Cody Rhodes was at the top of the mountain. But it was Jay Uso who shoved him back down! I can't believe what I've just seen. That has got to be the most shocking moment in WSC history as the Usos are now back together! This... This is disgusting! How can this man turn his back on Cody? After all the bloodline have put him through! I think Jay saw that the end was near for Roman Reigns. He was in dire straits, no one to help, and he had to choose between friend and family. And after everything that the bloodline has put him through, at the end of the day, Jay Uso still loves them. They're his blood, and he put family above all. Look at the face of the once great hardcore champion as his kingdom has fallen. Thanks to the NOIE Dynasty. What's next in the reign of the Tribal Chief? Whether you like it or you don't, the bloodline is now stronger than ever. That means bad things for everyone in WSC.